Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel NCRT Maths Hub. Today in this video, we will do worksheet number 53 for class 9 subject mathematics. Today our topic is quadrilateral and we all know that there are many forms of quadrilateral such as square, rectangle, parallelogram, trapezium, rhombus and kite and many other forms of quadrilateral are there. We must have understanding about these quadrilaterals. In the previous video, we have already learned that a diagonal of a parallelogram divide it into two congruent triangles. So here in the figure we have a parallelogram ABCD where AC is its diagonal. You can see here in the figure we have a parallelogram ABCD in which AC is diagonal and triangle ABC is congruent to triangle CDA. You can see here triangle ABC this triangle is congruent to triangle CDA. So the adjacent sides and adjacent angles of triangle ABC and CDA are always equal. So in the triangle ke adjacent side or adjacent angles aapke kya honge? equal honge. So here in this triangle ABC and triangle CDA you can see AB will be equals to CD. So AB will be equals to CD. Similarly BC will be equals to AD. So these are opposite sides of parallelogram and similarly BCA angle BCA this one angle this one and similarly here DAC this one. So angle 6 and angle 5 will be equal and similarly angle CAB means this angle here angle 3 and angle ACD this angle 4 so angle 3 will be equals to angle 4 that is CAB will be equals to ACD similarly angle ABC that is angle number 2 and will be equals to CB CDA that is angle number 2 1 so angle 1 will be equals to angle 2 so ABC will be equals to angle CDA so in a parallelogram opposite angles are equal so now we have some important points that in a quadrilateral, if opposite sides are equal, then the quadrilateral will be called as parallelogram. So here in quadrilateral PQRS, we have PQ equals to RS. So we are given <coughs> PQ equals to RS and QR equals to PS. I am repeating again here PQ is equals to RS and QR is equals to PS. So therefore the quadrilateral PQRS is a parallelogram and similarly in quadrilateral if opposite angles are equal then the quadrilateral will be called as parallelogram so in quadrilateral MNOP if angle MNO will be equals to MPO so you can see here angle MNO this angle 1 equals to angle MPO that is angle 2 so if angle 1 equals to angle 2 and angle PMN that is angle 3 and angle MNO sorry NOP equals to 4 so if 3 equals to 4 and angle 1 equals to angle 2 then the quadrilateral PM, PMNO or you can say MNOP will be a parallelogram. So now we have a practice question. So you can see here we are given a parallelogram that is EFGH. You can see on the screen. So here we have parallelogram EFGH. So in this parallelogram we have triangle EFH. You can see here EFH is congruent to triangle GHF. So the key job key respective positions are of course according triangle decide karni hai. So here triangle EFH will be congruent to triangle GHF. Keep in mind. So here this will be equals congruent to triangle GHF. Keep in mind. So now EF will be equals to. So EF will be equals to the side HG. So EF will be equals to side HG and angle HEF you can see here HEF so here this is HEF will be equals to angle HGF this will be equals to HGF so now we have fourth that is fourth angle that is EHF so we are here EHF this angle EHF will be equals to HFG so this angle will be equals to EHF will be equals to HFG keep in mind and now here FG side FG will be equals to EH so this will be equals to EH and now angle EHG you can see here EHG this complete angle EHG this complete angle will be equals to this complete angle that is angle EFG EFG and now GFH G G is here and 
एच इज हेयर सो दिस विल बी इक्वल्स टू दिस विल बी इक्वल्स टू ई एफ ई एफ एच कीप इन माइंड सो ऑल दीज आर द रिजल्ट ऑफ पैरोलोग्राम ई एफ जी एच एंड दिस इज ऑल अबाउट वर्कशीट नंबर फिफ्टी थ्री सो इफ यू लर्न फ्रॉम दिस वीडियो दैन प्लीज डू सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल एंड शेयर दिस वीडियो एज मच एज यू कैन थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग